it going, everyone? It's Liam Carson here. It's time for episode two of Agatha All Along. Uh, with Agatha back, uh, it's been a few years for her since, um, you know, there's been any semblance of reality, really, because she's been, of course, living in this fiction thanks to uh, the events of the final episode of uh, WandaVision. But um, she is back. Of course, we've had that warning about the uh, Salem 7. Um, so, yeah. And, of course, um, she is a bit powerless at the minute. So. So, yeah, but it was a really, it was really, really fun that first episode. Um, like I said, I really, really loved how we kind of um, adapted um, little bits of, um, or one of the, you know, elements that made WandaVision really, really stand out, um, but made it a bit more grittier and all of that. So, yeah, but of course, there was... Um, uh, just a lot of fun with that first episode, like especially between Vidal and um, and Agatha. So yeah, um, but let's get into the second episode. Looking forward to checking this out. So with that said, let's go. Shoes on these. <laughs> okay. I feel so bad for him. The house is yours, random boy. Be sure to tell the vengeance seekers I said hi. Tell me what is wrong. Oh. Please. Pretty please. The witch's road doesn't exist. You're lying. Am I? That's just what real witches say to keep the amateurs out. <laughs> the road will give you the thing you want the most. If you Fair enough. The That's why I saved you from the spell you were under. No. Boom. It was, it was <laughs> my pleasure. <laughs> you got a fad. If you've got the goods to break a spell cast by the Scarlet Witch. Yeah. What? Um. Say again. I'm He's Mephisto. <laughs> this is. Oh thing. my god! <laughs> Just what I was looking for. Uh. So, when she was driving in her Agnes stage. Yeah, basically. Ooh, heck. Uh, I'm over here. Oh, are you? Oh man, she's done with him. Oof. I don't think she lives there anymore, Agatha. Can you actually jot that down for me? There's a pen in the glove compartment. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm here for this duo. Uh, yeah, perfect. Okay. Right. Oh, do you jump in it? You know, it's it's. Yeah. I remember it. <laughs> she can't. De she can't deal with him. Day, madam. Oh, God. Oh, thank you so much for seeing us. We are hoping for a miracle today. Oh, this is my boy, Buford. Oh, he doesn't talk much. He's got social anxiety. <laughs> oh, my daddy God. Recently... And I am not interested. Oh, well. Rejected. Wait, what? Thank you for your purchase. Your bank statement will say Lilia's leggings, but that's just my side hustle. Oh, my God. <laughs> Like you were the reason people think we poison apples and steal children. And oh, you give babies. us the, the cliches. Oh, how old are you? 410, 415? How dare you? Oh, I apologize. <laughs> you don't look a day under 450 <laughs> years old. You get what? Maybe to coven up with the single most infamous witch on be this fun. continent? Oh, please. Name a batter bitch in South America or Europe. <laughs> Who is this child? I'm my pet. This is my pet. <laughs> Say hi, pet. Oh, wow. I found this on your door. <gasps> oh, someone's getting the boot. The path you're currently on leads nowhere. Join me. Us. <laughs> and return to your You essentially heard everything. Glory. You're on here. <gasps> what? Oh, damn. <laughs> Can't say no to you. <laughs> They're like, you're coming along on this journey. 
whether Neither you like it or not. Who's next? Oh no. That's just not, that's not a random crow. Mandatory Zen time. Hey, where do you keep your jade eggs? Oh God. I'm fresh out of marbles and my pelvic floor is all over the place. <laughs> Actually, you guys wanna go child sacrifice? I'm really sorry about your recent legal troubles. <gasps> oh, yes, I'm aware. Oh, I see what he's doing. Misrepresentation resulting. Yeah. Oh, wait, so you're magically bound and you're about to get literally bound. <laughs> None of this pedestrian drama would be an issue for a powered up witch. <gasps> oh. You think I haven't tried everything to unbind, you freaky little miscreant? Hey. The ballad, but it costs more than I make in a whole summer at the Hokey Pokey Bowl. I don't want to ever hear those words paired together again. <laughs> uh oh. Look, we all hate rats as well. Run. Run. Run! Oh my god! <laughs> you just have to throw him under the bus! Alice Wu Gulliver? I'm at the park. Wow. This is my familiar Toto. We need a protection <laughs> witch to join us on the witch's road. What do you say? You've been nothing but bad luck. You're fired. So you just what throw her the road to the this? bus. You're out of a job, and we're setting off for the road today. People like you are dangerous. Where are you from? Me? Originally, I mean, I was born in... Oh, my... Yeah, yeah. Did you get to know each other a little bit? <laughs> Drive faster. What? Okay. So, yeah. There is definitely uh, some... Yeah. I, I don't know if this is, like, if Wanda's put some kind of protective, um, spell on him. So yeah, this is definitely the Salem Seven. Keeping an eye, keeping an eye on. Oh my God, her mailbox! Come on. Jennifer Kale, potions. Lilia Calderu, divination. You're bound. And you need a chemical peel. Oh wow! Oh wow! Oh wow! This is never gonna work. <gasps> she showed. Your front door is name. It was a heart. A heart? Wait. A black heart. That's Vidal? because you used a black pen. <laughs> yeah, it was, um, Aubrey <gasps> Plaza. Oh, yoo uh, Agnes? <laughs> uh, well, you just, you look fabulous. Oh, thank you, Mrs. Hart. No, 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 oh, it's my Mrs. Davis. God. Oh, my oh, no, right. God. Mrs. Hart was what? Some people might need to squeeze in the back. You don't drive to the road. The road is conjured. Oh. So, um, like walking the, you don't together? drive on the yellow brick road. Upstairs. Let us just do our thing, okay? That's just not how they wrote the it. While you're at. So, who's going high? Oh, no, thank you. I don't take drugs. <laughs> She's talking about the harmonies. <laughs> I'm an alto, that's all I'm saying. Get off me! <laughs> oh. You're volunteering. <laughs> Seekest thou the road to all that's foul and fair? Oh God, we're going for a musical number. Love it, love it. Let's go. Gather sisters, circle soul with fate. Unlock thy hidden gate. <laughs> She's just like, oh man. Marching ever forward. Oh sh! The what the hell? Shine. Was this Ruby's mother? <laughs> oh my god. If sun be gone, oh my god! Spirit as <laughs> He's like, oh hell no, I'm not dealing with this shit. Oh my god! It's picking up, isn't it? Oh, nice. Come on, kid, let's do this. To glory at the end. 
正嘅，得噶。Oh my God! Then what the hell? What's going on up there? What a team of rejects. Wait. Coward. Wait, wait. Fraud. What's she doing? Disappointment. I think I know what she's doing. She's trying to get a little taste of magic. Shut up. Go to hell. Make me. Wait. Huh? This is a power grab. She wants us to attack her. Yeah. Is this the road? Because we should really, really go like right now. Oh my god! Yeah, let's just sing it. Let's just sing it. Oh my god, what the exorcist! Guess we're on the witch's road. I never doubted us for a second. No? Don't know what everyone was getting so worked up for. <laughs> it's gonna be uncomfortable though, surely. Oh man. Fun. Absolutely fun. That song was just sick. Absolutely cool. Loved it. Absolutely loved it. Yeah. So, yeah, we're on the road. Uh Yeah, I was that was that was honestly fun now. Um so, yeah. Um it was just great to see this ascent, this uh, the the coven getting assembled, basically. Um, so yeah, but um, um, yeah, it was it was just really really fun stuff. Uh, and there's of course the curiosity in regards to the kid, uh, how any kind of personal information is just silenced, and I'm guessing that is Wonder putting a a kind of protection spell on him. So yeah. Um, but, yeah, it was, it was just great. The Salem Seven are terrifying. Like, honestly, I mean, no, the, the design is just kind of haunting. Uh, and, of course, the movement is just like, oof, uh, back off Satan. No, they're not Salem Seven. They're Satan Seven. Because back off Satan, right? So, yeah, but we got our, we got our crew. Um, even though, like, Sharon is replacing Vidal, so, yeah, but, uh, it was just, uh, really, really, uh, great stuff, so, yeah. So, yeah, that was a blast, um, yeah, I've really enjoyed these, uh, two episodes in terms of establishing things, uh, now that we're on the road, uh, like, that first episode was really great in terms of bringing Agatha, uh, into the fold of things after she was basically a prisoner in Wanda's um, spell. And, and then this episode really got the cover, well, this this uh, like little coven, this little team up and all of that. Um, as well as, you know, they're not thrilled meeting um, Agatha and all of that again. Um, so, yeah. And it was just really, really, um, you know, fun stuff to see how Agatha, uh, you know, with her reputation and all of that, how... Um, they were not really thrilled to uh, to 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 see Agatha again, but it felt like they didn't really have uh, any kind of choice but to go along with things. With you know what was at stake and all of that, like especially like Jennifer, for example, that was just wild with what the you know the teen pulled up and all of that in terms of uh, how uh, how 
she wasn't exactly in a good position. So yeah, um, so yeah, and and how they're all different as well in terms of what they, I guess, major in in terms of their witchiness. So um, yeah, but it was just really really fun stuff um, to um, be on this journey to try and gather them uh, in in you know differing in different ways and all of that. So yeah. Um, but it was just absolutely uh, great because, as I've said, with the fact that they have, um, they, they, they have not, they don't want to be on this journey. They have to though. And it's, it was just really, really great to see like Ag uh, Agatha and the kid, uh, basically, force them into a position where they have really no choice but to, to follow through, really. So, yeah. Um, whether it's personal... Well, like, because that's it, though. Like, we've got Alice with uh, those personal stakes in regards to what happened to her mom and Jennifer, you know, with lawsuits kicking her butt. It's just really, really fun stuff. Like, to see these characters try to get... Uh, to, to, to see uh, Agatha and the kid try to get the one up on what's what looks to be an impossible situation, um, only for them to to pull through. So, yeah, but um, yeah, it was. I mean, it was just really, really uh, great stuff in, in in general, and I love how they pulled Sharon into things as well. Like her, uh, whilst they were singing the song, I just loved how she was like, "I don't know the words. I'm just gonna. I'm just happy to be involved." I'm just happy to be involved in a group. So, yeah. Of course, she's replacing Vidal, isn't she? So, um, yeah. But I'm assuming Aubrey's going to, like, obviously show up later on uh, and whatnot. So, yeah. But um, still, it was just really, really fun stuff. I got to say, banger of a, of a song. That was just great. So good. Um, so, yeah. Um but this is what I'm here for. This is a real, like, this is a show that seems to be a very, very, like, it, it seems to throw, at least for me, it throws me in for a really, really good time. And I'm really liking that because, uh, you know, this has been a lot of fun, uh, these two episodes. Um, I think there's like nine episodes, if I um, am correct. I just want to have a double check, actually. Uh, but, um, I mean, it was just really really uh great stuff so yeah there are nine episodes so um to see how things are going to go along um now now that we're on this road is going to be it, it's going to be very very great um so yeah but um yeah the teen obviously continuing that mystique like i said i mean i think w with him like most likely being wiccan um and i and i think with him being um, Billy, I mean, I feel like, um, it's leading towards that path, and obviously, well, to be fair, I think it's not the intention, is it, in terms of, oh, we're gonna pretend that you guys are dumb and all of that, um, I think a lot of, uh, people have figured it out, but I think it's for Agnes to decode, uh, or Agatha, should I say, uh, I think it's for her to decode on her own. So yeah, um, I mean it will be very it would be very very interesting to see how things will go along in regards to um, what will come out and all of that. But um, yeah, because that's it though. He was pe he, he was talking about his name and where he grew up, uh, and he did mention Eastview. So yeah, but apart from that. It just, yeah, it, it it was just non-existent, wasn't it, in terms of, like, um, dialogue and uh, what we were able to decipher because it was just completely muffled. So, um, I mean, that's it, though. He, it wasn't like anything else because uh, Agatha could turn the song on, uh, just could turn the radio on. But, yeah, and that was just very, very interesting. So, I don't know if one just put a kind of protection spell uh on on billy uh on wiccan so yeah but we'll just have to wait and see but i i mean i do do find it very very interesting um that um they they've gone that route in terms of um whenever 
Agatha is trying to learn more about the teen. Yeah, it it, it the magic uh, kicks in and all of that. So yeah, um, so it was just very very interesting to do that um, as a, as a way to kind of protect his identity. Like I said, I'm not sure if it's for us, but more so for Agatha. Like it's going to potentially test her limit. Like right now. It's more so curiosity than um, annoyance, but I feel like it's going to get to a point where she does get annoyed and she does want to. Uh, she does want to find out what is going on. So, yeah, but um, yeah, I felt like it was just really, really uh, fun stuff. So yeah, um, and I just loved uh, going to uh, the teen and Agatha and how obviously she was not able to to hear him on personal information when it comes to their banter in terms of their connectivity it was just really really great i just really loved there were moments where she was just so done with his shit and he's just so i just loved his um his, his attitude um so upbeat so fun uh, and it and it and it you know it, it, it's so well done when it comes to Agatha and, and how she's just not having any of it. So, <laughs> yeah. Um, so he is he is absolutely uh, killing it, is Joe. Um, he's an absolute fanboy and you just love his enthusiasm. So, yeah. But also, it, it's it's not so... It, he's not a liability at the end of the day. Sure, he can be anno annoying in the eyes of Agatha, but he's he's still someone that can be of good help so yeah um so yeah awesome stuff um and the salem seven um because i was sure like especially with how agatha was looking at that crow or whatever um and she was getting deterred like she was not feeling too confident when she saw you know that and the rat showing up as well as the wolf i was thinking yeah is that the salem seven and all of that like um i find i would find it hard to think that with agatha um she would be thrown off by just a random crow or whatever she would be absolutely grossed out by a raven um or oh, a rat should i say so um yeah, I was thinking, yeah, this is this is what she was warned about, surely. Um, and then we saw them in that, I guess, their full forms. Um, like I said, creepy as hell. Um, so, yeah. Um, they move like, yeah, they, they move like um, demonic uh, terrors and all of that. They are absolutely uh, sinister, so... Uh, yeah, we're getting our first dose of them, and, uh, ooh, so, ooh. um, but yeah, it was really, really, um, good stuff, um, yeah, had a lot of fun with these two episodes, and I'm excited to see what episode three has in store, so, yeah, but, uh, with that said, I'll see you guys next time, hope you guys enjoyed this reaction, you check my videos on the right, if you want to check out more of my content, you can also subscribe to my media feeds and channel if you want to, hope you guys enjoyed this reaction, hope you guys take care, and I'll see you guys next time. Toodles!